Good morning. Good morning, Hector. So you've said in the past you've expressed your disapproval for cremation, and you said that you needed your body to enter heaven, and I just wanted to understand what caused you to believe that. Well, I'm not for being cremated because I don't know if I'm going to need my body parts when I get up there, right? Suppose I need my liver or my heart, and God like, where your heart? Oh, I burned up. <laughs> so, just, but I can't, I won't be in the hand of the burning part either. I've never liked fire. So do you think that even though you're dead, there's some possibility that you can experience pain when your body's being cremated? I don't know, and I don't want to take that risk. <laughs> <laughs> I was just wondering because I, I've heard... I've heard people say similar things about how you need your body to enter heaven. And I'm just saying, like, what if you suddenly die and you don't have a will in place and people don't know that you don't want to be cremated? Right. And, well, I'm telling and, everybody and, right now, <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be cremated. So, okay, but is this, so you strongly believe that you need your body to enter Well, you heaven. know, somebody, according to the Bible, some people would take him back up into heaven, right? And, and their, right. their whole body and everything went, right? I think Elisha was one of them. Yeah, so something is up with that. If Elijah can take his body, I want to take <laughs> mine. 